Your Daily Journey with God, April 23rd. Count it all joy. Our light affliction, which is but for a moment, is working for us a far more exceeding and eternal weight of glory. That's from 2 Corinthians 4, verse 17. As Christians, we live by a principle that flies in the face of modern human sensibility. We walk by faith, not by sight. While the modern man says, I'll believe it when I see it, the spiritual man says, I believe God's word, whether I see it or not. The biblical position is not just believing in the absence of evidence. It is believing in the fact and in the face of evidence to the contrary. Take James 1 verse 2 for instance. How are we to have joy in the midst of trials? How are we to count suffering as a blessing when it doesn't look or feel like a blessing? Is that just a game? Just an example of mind over matter? No. It's an example of walking by faith rather than by our senses. When things are difficult, we should ask first, what has God said? He has said that trials are a reason for joy. Next, we should count it so. That is, we should say to ourselves, I choose to believe that the situation I'm in is a potential source of joy in my life, regardless of how it feels because that's what God has said. Amen. When you are, if you are in the midst of a trial right now, choose to walk by faith. Choose to count it all joy. To add an affliction, he addeth his mercy. To multiply trials, he multiplied peace. It's a quote by Annie Johnson Flint.